India made a quantum leap in satellite technology when a consortium of four startups decided to make a constellation of 12 private sector satellites. I have with me Mr. Prateep Basu, founder and CEO of SatShore, one of the four members of the consortium. And he represents on behalf of all four. Thanks a lot for speaking to me, Prateep. Thank you, sir. What sir. is this uh, satellite uh, constellation? A satellite constellation which I'm calling Prithvi Drishti. <laughs> That's a great name, sir. Uh, thank you so much. Actually, the constellation uh, is supposed to meet the sovereign needs of our country, uh, which is why it includes the different uh, kinds of sensor type. So we have the very high resolution optical uh, cameras there, which Pixel will be making. What, what does Dhruva do? We have right behind us Dhruva. Right. So one of your partners. Dhruva is one of our partners led by Sanjay Nekanti. They are the ones who are uh, providing us the ground stations, the mission support. Uh, uh, and uh, they are one of our key partners in the ground segment uh, uh, side. So they are, they are doing the ground segment. And, and, and what is PeerSight doing? PeerSight is also doing some satellites? Yes, sir. So PeerSight uh, is doing two satellites which are uh, called uh, synthetic aperture radar satellites. These are the ones which can do the imaging in day and night cloud or no cloud and uh, are extremely important for intelligence surveillance reconnaissance maritime and uh, surface deformation kind of studies and they are doing two satellites yes what is pixel doing pixel is well known for its uh, Hyperspectral satellites, what is Pixel doing in your consortium? So, Sir, Pixel is the lead of our consortium uh, and uh, they are uh, uh, developing both the hyperspectral uh, satellites, the high resolution 5 meter one that they have already launched. Is this one of the satellites which they are going to be making or something similar like this? <laughs> I, I guess it's a different generation of the sat uh, um, satellite. A better generation than yes, this. Yes. <laughs> but they will be making how many satellites? So, uh, they'll be making a, a, a total of uh, seven Under satellites. 12 of them. Under 12. Well, seven satellites will be done by uh, Pixel, which will be both hyperspectral as well as the very high resolution optical uh, ones. Okay. Now, beyond that, what is your company, SatShore, going to be doing? So, my company, SatShore, is one of those unique uh, uh, you know, entities that does both the upstream hardware work as well as the downstream analytics work. So, in this constellation, we are uh, uh, doing... Uh, a total of three multispectral and optical satellites, which are going to be sub-meter resolution, but 65 kilometers swath, meaning that we will have extremely high coverage over large areas. But the more important thing is that since we are already an established player in solutions, uh, which is using satellite data and AI, so we will be also aggregating the data uh, coming from the different sensors and building the solutions for India across different verticals like agriculture, forestry, energy, infrastructure, etc. Now, this consortium of four companies, what is the specific commercial model for this? And you got an approval from the regulator in India in space. What does that mean? Right. So, uh, the commercial model for us is the same as our existing businesses where we are, uh, you know, launch building these satellites now under a single umbrella, which makes it very easy for an end user, whether it's a civilian user or a commercial uh, user, to to actually get the intelligence out of it. So, there are different types of commercial model. One is directly data sales for cartographic applications, for ISR applications. Uh, then there are the solution sales, which is uh, where you know companies like SatShore and uh, Pixel also uh, excel. Uh, and uh, then the, I would say the, the last part would be also licensing the models that we develop because we will be generating so much data. And today in the world of AI, it is impossible to not uh, uh, have your internal AI capabilities to analyze all of How this. much will you be investing in this uh, 12 satellite constellation, which will be the first private sector satellite constellation from India? Right. So, uh, the final cost outlay of it has to be submitted uh, uh, to, to in space. The ones that we had given were slightly above the reported 1200 uh, crores. Uh, and I can tell you it's between some... Uh, like 1300 to 1400 crores is the current outlay for us. And that is going to be invested by each of the private sector companies from their own funds. Absolutely. And uh, we didn't see it necessary to be taking a, uh, taking the money from the government in the form of a loan when, uh, you know, we ourselves have existing businesses that rely uh, on uh, such data and customers like what uh, we get. So it shows the maturity from a startup becoming a full-fledged 
a revenue generating company in times to come absolutely i think uh, uh, we wanted to also set an example uh, that uh, yeah. we are we are here to do business and uh, for that we just need the right kind of support which is support to give it the demand aggregation of demand we can build our uh, technology and innovation and we can raise capital on it thanks a lot pratip thank you sir so that was mr pratip basu founder and ceo of satsure but representing all the four companies pixel peer site and dhruva four have gotten together to give india its first private sector earth imaging constellation a constellation i call prithvi drishti so will prithvi drishti deliver quality images for india only time will tell with camera person ashok male in new delhi palav bagla for ndtv